What is Brown syndrome? Brown syndrome is also known as um, superior oblique tendonitis. Okay, what it happens is is the, su the superior oblique muscle, which is, which is one of the six uh, muscles of uh, extraocular muscles of the eye, it goes through a little tiny um, hole. It's it's a little out out pocketing where it, it actually goes through something called a trochlea. It slides in and out of this little tiny. Um, this little tiny knuckle, and it goes through there. And the, it, the superior oblique muscle slides through this thing. If that becomes inflamed or it becomes tight, the muscle cannot slide through that little tiny opening. And what you get is an inability to, for the child to elevate the eyes upward and inward. And when you look at the child, he might look perfectly normal. But when he looks at you upward, you won't see his eye elevate on that side. Sometimes the parents think it's the other eye because the other eye is shooting up and the other eye is staying still. So you could be fooled in thinking a Brown syndrome, which is a muscle problem of the eye, is in the other eye. It's actually in the eye that doesn't elevate. Most kids with Brown syndromes are asymptomatic. The parent notices it just by chance. Why? Because the parent is taller than the child. The parent looks down at the child, the child looks up at the parent, the parent sees that the eyes are not actually working together. Uh, we don't usually have to operate on a Brown syndrome because Brown syndrome only affects up gaze. It doesn't affect primary or down gaze. Very rarely, or not that significantly, it sometimes affects primary gaze and then what we have to do is a, is a certain procedure on the superior oblique to release it or to lengthen it so that it can slide properly. Can this be born with? or can be withdrawal later in life? Most of the times Brown syndromes, the child is born with it. He might, it might not be noticed early on. Most parents who come in with children with Brown syndrome are above one, year, one years of age. Sometimes inflammatory conditions can cause Brown syndrome and in that case it will get worse over time. We sometimes can use anti-inflammatory medications to, to treat it.